previously on The Quarantine Crew. For months, Shelley Warfenpoodle has graciously entertained us with engaging interviews, educational workout segments, and heartwarming American moments. I just miss my mom. I just miss her so much. Little did he know, something was undermining his brilliance. Tim and Tom, Shelley's top field reporters and best friends, gave in to their own unbridled jealousy. First, Shelley was blindsided when Tim quit the show due to being dumb and stupid. Now, Tom's incompetence might get him fired. Are you really gonna fire your best friend? I don't know, am I? Will Tom continue to work for the greatest show on Earth? Will Shelley fire his best friend? Now, the thrilling conclusion. Yeah, you're fired. Okay. Well, quarantiners, Tim and Tom might be gone, but that's okay, because the show, it's, it's gonna be bigger, it's, it's gonna be bolder and brighter and, and more beautiful than ever. And that's because I plan on hiring the best reporter in the biz. Can you hear me, Johnny? Hello? Hey, Johnny, mate, uh, how you doing, man? Uh, crazy, but this uh, a position just opened up on Quarantine Crew. How would you like to co-run the show with me? Really? Did Tom quit? Uh, you know, things didn't, things didn't quite work out between us. So what do you say? What do I say? <laughs> what do I say? <laughs> <laughs> so what do you say? I say I would never work for a show run by a failure like you! <laughs> This whole time, you didn't even recognize me once. It was so easy, so easy, Shelly. Who are you? Do you recognize me now? Jack? Last to the finish line, as always, Shelly Warfin Poodle. You're pathetic. Do you even know what the Nub Republic is? It's not even a real place. All this time, it's been me. Do you honestly think that idiot Tom even knows how to work a circuit breaker? Tom, what the hell? Well, I probably... And Tim, getting chased by that car. Do you think that was just some driving Daniel? Who do you think was driving the car that hit you? What? No. Ever since this quarantine started, I've been planting seeds of division in your crew. Every petty argument, every misunderstanding, everything that went wrong in your stupid show, it was me. I mean, you built an empire with this new show and I broke it down like a tent. A, a tent? It, you know, like with the, with the poles and the- You sabotaged this show. Why? Oh, come on. You're up there in your perfect paradise of a bunker thinking you're so great when really you're no better than us bottom feeders. No, 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 that's not true. I'm special, I'm a news reporter. A news reporter. You're an unemployed actor who used a global crisis for exposure. That's a lie. This is different. I'm different. You're right. We're not the same. You're unrelatable. No! And now you're all alone. <laughs> All right, how do I, uh, how do I get out of this to, thing? You have to just quickly meeting, make me a host. Oh, okay, I got it. Thanks. Bye. Okay, bye. Well, quarantiners, I guess from here on out, this is a one-man crew. I'm all alone. I'm Shirley Worf and Poodle, signing off. <laughs>